hello guys so in this video we will learn about how we can use set interval and clear interval so right here on your screen you can see I have written some JavaScript code here with the HTML and here you can see I have created one function and that function uh, I am calling from the button click event and I have also like written one more function for logging okay and from here I have implemented the count and after like when count is greater than 5 then I am calling another met function to clear the interval so first let me just comment it out okay just to see what is going okay so now i am going to open it in the browser so you can see here like let me also open the console so that we can check the log okay and here let me click on the start interval so when I clicked on the start interval then after each three second I am getting the console like one two and one two three is the count basically let me show you that part so here you can see when I clicked on that button this function got called and after that and then on each three second like we are setting the interval basically and basically we inside this interval I am calling this function log function here count is getting increased one by one and that count is being con concatenated in with the string okay and here it will keep repeating and it will not reach up to this function okay so here you can see let me open the browser again so you can see it will keep increasing 20 21 until we close the browser and till that time it will keep coming like this so what we can do here to not if like whenever if we want to stop then we just need to call the clear interval and that part is like here in this set interval method it is returning uh, its identity inside its assigned values okay and from here in the, from the values we can we can clear the interval so first let me as you can see here I am create clearing the interval here value and it is I have taken it as a global variable here and I am like clearing it inside this function clear interval for values so when I will un let me uncomment this and save the same file again so here you can see now I am checking right here one condition if the count is greater than or equal to 5 then I am allowing it to clear the interval okay so that we need not to see the count message again in the log so let me go to the browser okay so you can see uh, let me also clear this so you can see it is still keep coming right 55 56 okay so let me clear this or refresh this page first so I have refreshed this page again okay so now you can see nothing is coming by default and once I will click this button set start interval and then in each three second you can see we got one hello now we will get two hello in the same way three then four and then five and then here you can see clearing intervals log is coming and that that means here this log got printed here 
when it entered into this method is this clear interval for values function so and after printing this message it cleared the interval and you can see now we are not getting any message like six hello message we did not get so like this you can use the interval I mean st like this you can use uh, set interval and clear interval according to your uh, requirement in your project so I think you got the idea about the working of set interval and clear interval right so that's all guys for this in this video okay so see you in the next video thank you and don't forget to subscribe the channel okay